Hi Freunde, die Episode von Life Strange ist noch nicht vorbei. Wir machen weiter bei der Vortex Club Party. Viel Spaß. Nathan enjoys his last party. Chloe, we can go right to the cops. We have proof. Fuck the police. Rachel wanted us to find her. So we could get real justice. And revenge. The Prescotts have had this coming for a hundred years, and nobody is gonna get in my way. Especially with your help. Right? I'm with you to the end, Chloe. You know that. I can't tell if they're different. What is that? that? Can't be too Jesus, moved. Chloe, look up at the sky. Possible. Beautiful. I don't give a shit. The world is ending. Cool. You're not listening. Something major is going down. That's right. Nathan Prescott is going down. Welcome to the end of the world, ladies. I'm glad you decided to escort me. You look really good, Warren. Are you all right after today? I'm glad you stopped me. Nathan is dangerous. Where is he? I didn't see him at the dorm again. I was held up in my room. Dude, have you been drinking? <laughs> well, if you consider half a beer drinking. Let's go, Max. Hey, hey. I know this is a bad time, but can I get one picture? I've been feeling like this might be actually the end of the world, so I want to have something for prosperity. Well, I don't blame you, Warren. I know, I know. I'm pain in the booty. Just one picture. Uh. Action. We've got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. Sorry. I just wanted to feel like a normal student after this week's ultra-violence. I never hit anybody like that before. I was always the one getting my ass kicked. Hey, we still need your expert help. If you see Nathan, text me immediately, okay? And do not let him see you. He won't. I know how to be invisible here. Not to me, Warren. Text soon. Willkommen zur Vortex Club Party. Ähm, der letzte Part hat sehr abrupt aufgehört, aber ich habe gedacht, es war ein guter Zeitpunkt, den Part da enden zu lassen. Mich wundert es auch ehrlich gesagt, dass die Episode da nicht aufgehört hat. Aber gut, ihr werdet sehen, was am Ende dieser Episode passiert. Und dann wisst ihr, warum es nicht aufgehört hat. Okay. Gehen wir mal da rein. Welcome to the end of the world. Do you want me to check anything in? Uh, no thanks, Stella. Have you seen Nathan yet? No, thank God. That boy creeps me out. Wait, some girl just asked about Nathan before you came in. What girl? She had blue hair, dressed like a punk. I've seen her putting up those Rachel Amber posters. I'm stuck here, so I'm sorry I can't help you. So why are you working at a Vortex Club party? I didn't think you wanted to be a member. Screw that. I'm here for the job. Do you notice anything unusual about the Vortex Club tonight? Yeah, I noticed they don't give a shit about Kate Marsh. I'm glad for the job, but I think Principal Wells should have canceled the party. Guess I'm not cool enough. 
Yes, you are, Stella. You're smart, honest, and you bust your ass for Blackwell. I hope everything turns out your way in the end. Well, thank you, Max. I really appreciate that. Hey, your face looks so intense. Are you okay? Uh, no, I'm actually not okay. I, I just need to find Nathan. And don't get too close if you see him. Hell no. This is homework, not a party. I'll text you if I spy him. Good luck. So, das Spiel wird jetzt im nächsten Abschnitt extrem laut, weswegen ich wahrscheinlich nicht viel sagen werde. Ich wollte es nur mal ankündigen. Und ja, kein Wunder, dass es so angespannt ist nach dem, was ich gesehen hat. Gehen wir mal rein. <lacht> okay, äh, ich weiß, dass es hier ein Foto gab, genau. Es war klar, oder? Es war klar. Hey. <lacht> so. Okay, wir müssen in den VIP-Bereich. Ah, the wit of the Vortex Club. Ah, jetzt versteht man mich wahrscheinlich auch besser. Äh, hier gab es noch ein Foto und zwar genau so, ja. I'm not in the mood, but still, this could be an interesting shot. Jetzt weiß ich nicht, ob ich noch irgendwas brauche für den Zugang. Äh ah ja, für den Zugang zum, zum Vortex Club, zum VIP-Bereich. Somebody's either having sex or throwing up. Gross. How did this even get here? Ah, uh, kranke Party. Chloe must be around. <laughs> Chloe must be around. Guck mal hier, der Megusta. Going in. Sorry, but this is the VIP section. Members only. Okay? I don't give a shit about being a member. I just want to talk Victoria to Victoria specifically told me not to let you in. Nice try. Too bad you're not a member. Listen! No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. I need to find a way to enter this bullshit club. Also müssen wir die Courtney finden. Ich 
glaube, wir sind vorhin sogar an der vorbeigelaufen. Da. Hey, Courtney. How are you? Uh, what is Max Caulfield doing at a Vortex Club party? It really must be the end of the world. Get it? But seriously, like, what do you want? I didn't want to be alone tonight after this week, so I thought it'd be nice to hang out in the VIP function. Yes, it is very nice. If you're in the Vortex Club, which you're not and will never be. So, excuse me. Great plan, Max. Time to find another way into the VIP section. Energy drinks, soda, energy drinks. I know somebody has those. Irgendein Trick muss es doch geben. Hello, Brooke. Max, I didn't expect to see you at a Vortex Club party. I didn't expect that either, but I really need to find Nathan. Have you? No, I haven't seen him. And I'm not looking for him, so I most likely won't tonight. I just hate that scrub. And his club. You're not the only one. Maybe this party will be the end of the Vortex Club. Then I don't have to pretend like I care anymore. Have you seen Warren tonight? Why? You're the one going out with him. Oh, enough. I, I am sorry Warren asked me to the movies. But you don't need to give me an attitude. I'd like to think I'm your friend. I know. I get salty when things don't go my way. I'm selfish while you go on a roof to help save your friend. You're not selfish, bro. You're just trying to live your life without all this bullshit. Like all of us here. You seem so wise and kind of invincible this week. I think that snow and eclipse gave you superpowers. Check to see if you can fly. Only with your drone. By the way, did you see that crazy double moon out there earlier? Max, if I saw a double moon out there, I would assume it really was the end of the world. Well, the night is still young. And so are we, Max. So let's plan a drone date next week. Okay, sie ist zwar freundlich zu mir, aber wirklich geholfen hat's nix. Yes, you do so. Okay, vielleicht habe ich doch hier drin Glück. If I get uh, sick now, ripped already, Justin. I can drink more and later. And not happy. Why did you even come tonight? Where else could I go in Arcadia Bay on a Thursday night? Besides, Dana is here. Just not with me. So yes, this party sucks. Speaking of, have you seen Nathan? Oh, he should be freaking out in the VIP lounge with that whore tex club. Fucking hate those snobby douchebags. Especially Nathan. That dude is gonna go on a rampage soon. You might be right, so stay away from him tonight, okay? Spread the word. Max, I know I'm twisted, but your face looks so fucking intense. And your voice sounds different. You okay? How about a quick dab? Uh, no, I'm, I'm cool, Justin. And I have to get going. Maybe you should go chill somewhere else. Fucking A, Maximus. You're right. I'm only torturing myself here. Plus, I'm too loaded. It's time to get my board and grind. <laughs> Mit wem könnte ich noch reden? Keinem anscheinend. Das heißt, wir müssen woanders hin. Jetzt wird's wieder laut. Sorry. God, are you mental? You can't come in. Don't stress, Courtney. I'm still getting into the VIP section. Die Frage ist nur wie. Okay? DJ, what the fuck? 
wie macht man das am geschicktesten? Ah, ich bin jetzt einfach auf der anderen Seite. Ha, perfekt. Und so kommen wir von hinten rum rein. Oh, mal ein bisschen Ruhe. Ach, oh, wie schön. Wäre vielleicht nicht schlecht. Nathan scheint aber nicht hier zu sein. Kate was dosed at the last Vortex Club party by Nathan. So you should avoid any drink here tonight. But trust me, I won't even drink my own water when Nathan is around now. He's a pharmacy simulator. I do have to go now. Look out for yourself, Taylor. And give my best to your mom. Oh, thanks, Max. She's doing great after her surgery. I'm glad to know you're looking out for us too. So, wo hockt sie denn? Ach du Scheiße. She's wasted and nobody is looking out for her. Nobody learns at Blackwell. I love talking with Lily. What's up, Hayden? Oh, look. Up in the sky. It's Super Max here to save the party. Have you seen Nathan? I just vaped some dank OG buds, so I can barely see you. Or are these hotties next to me? Go ahead. No. I want to find Nathan. Me too! He's supposed to be bringing some special party favors. I hope at the party you actually planned a party at the party. Not this week. So has anybody here seen Nathan? I guess you have to go ask everybody here. Or you can sit down and take a quick hit. What about Victoria? Yeah, go ask her yourself. I would, but like I said, I'm fucking wrecked. 
Maybe you better take this easy one. Whatever. I'm in this world to have fun. Try it sometime, Max. I finally get you and Dana to come out to a Vortex Club party, but you just want to lecture me? Gee, thanks, Mr. Madsen. How much fun did Kate have at your last party? Listen, Kate. Just watch out for Nathan Tina. I think that's your job, Max. Come back when you're ready. Wo ist die Victoria? Ich finde sie einfach nicht. Ah! Sorry, Max. Vortex Club members only. Sorry. I'm on the guest list. I'm taking you off. Go fuck yourself, in Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. And after I apologized to you the other day. Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Kate Marsh tried to kill herself in front of you. And me. Everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even try to blame me. I blame Nathan for dosing Kate, but nobody at that party even cared she was so wasted. It's a fucking party! Everybody is wasted! What do you want from me? Some humanity, Victoria. Well, you got Nathan busted out of Blackwell, so you should be happy. And I'm the only person here who cares what Nathan is going through. This is bigger than a problem, child. I'm not perfect, okay? I'm a teenager at an art school. I'm only here to become a photographer and get famous. Is that what you were trying to tell Mr. Jefferson last night? Uh, you saw me talking to him? Saw and heard. We were just talking about how excited he is for the Everyday Heroes contest. That doesn't mean I'm going to win or anything. I hope you win fair. We'll see. And Max, I know you don't like me either, so it's not like we have to be friends or anything. Maybe, but who says we have to be enemies? Whoever makes that decision. That would be us, Victoria. Well, Max Caulfield, I could always choose to let you in the Vortex Club. I don't think that's going to happen. But not for the reasons you think. Oh, you look so serious. Ich sag ihr über den Dark Room Bescheid. Victoria, listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. I know Nathan is your friend, but he is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so he could take her from Star. What? Nice try, Max. But I don't believe you. And why would he do that? That I don't know. But it was enough to make Kate want to die. And I think you're next. Max, that is crazy. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. His family treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. I don't care if you hate me or not. You have to believe me. You could have been a major bitch to me when I got hit with that paint, and I deserved it. Max, I don't hate you. I actually think you're one of the coolest people at Blackwell. Weird, but cool. You just don't know it yet. Maybe I'm jealous because you don't give a shit what anybody thinks, and I do. To be honest, Nathan has been freaking me out lately. He's not here, and I haven't seen him. Just make sure you stay away from me and stick close to your friends tonight, okay? I let you boss me around this one time. And I have other people I can go to for protection. Thanks for telling me this, Max. If what you said is true, then you be careful too. I've got my own protection. Um, text me if you need anything. I will. Thanks, Victoria. Au revoir. Maybe there's hope yet for Victoria. I'm glad I won't hurt her. So that's my party. Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the locker. Damn. 
Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Well, let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So, we made it. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Jefferson. <laughs> Are you both okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just looking for Nathan. Uh-huh. I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He, he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the, the uh, the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost gone. Let's get the hell out of here, Max. Okay, okay, everybody calm down. Thank you. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. I, look, I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about entering. Now, this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. The envelope, please. And the winner is... Come on! Oh my, what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Mr. Jefferson, it was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to Kate Marsh. <laughs> she is the real everyday hero of Blackwell, and I can't wait for her to come back. Thank you. Victoria won. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Yes, I can. Who fucking cares? Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass. Now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Shit. We have to go to the junkyard right now. Right. Just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump us. Oh, ich dachte, die Episode ist schon vorbei. Ist er aber nicht. <lacht> also. Ich weiß ehrlich gesagt nicht mehr, was hier war. What the hell? Oh, gross. God, I'm gonna fucking kill that little psycho. Hey, I can't focus if you're yelling. Please. When we catch Nathan, you better rewind so I can kill him over and over. Look, we can't track Nathan if you're not going to be cool. Ich weiß gar nicht, ob wir ihr hinterherlaufen müssen, aber ich vermut's mal schon, oder? Max, please hurry. Oh God, Max, look. She's still there. 
Don't look, Chloe. Oh, no. Chloe, look out. What the fuck? So, Freunde, das war's jetzt aber mit der Episode. <lacht> ähm, ich überspringe die Credits, dann können wir noch mal ganz kurz gucken, was hier so abgeht. Mhm, mh, mh, mh. Dann sehen wir noch die Entscheidungen. Und ihr seht eine Preview für die nächste Episode. Vielen Dank fürs Zuschauen und bis zum nächsten Mal. Ciao!